Hey, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on where or when you're watching this. It's me, your friendly neighborhood deacon, Deacon Gene. And uh, it's Wednesday. Or should I be saying, buongiorno a tutte to all my paisanos and gumbadis out there in YouTube land or Instagram land or Facebook land or whatever land or even those of you that are actually in Italy. Howdy, how you doing? It's Wednesday. It's hump day. Yes, we made it. And it's Italian shave day. We made it. We're halfway there. We're on the downslope to the weekend. It's going to be a great weekend. I, I, I know it's going to be a good weekend. And the rest of the week is going to be smooth sailing. All right. So, what are we doing today? Uh, well, other than going to the office and doing my stuff, we're shaving today. Duh. That's why we're here. Uh, as some of you may know, um, Andy Amayo over at uh, the Wet Shaving Store is having some health issues and we're trying to brighten his spirits a little bit. And uh, I know we're doing a uh, Dougie Shaving, oh, Doug Embry has started a GoFundMe to help with some of the medical expenses. I'm going to put a link in the bottom down there uh, to the GoFundMe page. If you can, whatever you can, if you can. If, if you're not able to, you can find Andy on Instagram. You can find him on Facebook. Shoot him a note. Set, tell him you're sending some love and enlightenment. Enlightenment. Blah, blah, blah. Take two. Love and enlightenment. And some prayers and whatever. And good wishes. Uh, and that, yeah, that sort of thing. So what we're doing today, a lot, a lot of people are doing, is we're, we're using a product that was put out in collaboration with Wet Shaving Store. I know um, I was talking to a Millennial Shaver the other day, and he and I are both using the same product today. And that would be the one that started it all with Shave Dad. Vanulet put it together. Shave Dad. Wet Shaving Store. Made man, this guy right here. It's got that old Brooklyn-y nice barbershop type scent. It's got the leather, it's got the talc, it's got a little bit of everything. And man, I am so sorry that this is going because this is unobtainium. At least made man is unobtainium. And I'll say no more. All right, and you know me, I'm Mr. Matchy Matchy. I got the matching splash, and I've got something very special for the cologne. And it, it pairs extremely well, if you know what I mean. You know what I mean. It's called Mafia Gentleman, and it, it pairs, ex like I said, extremely well with this. Also from Vanulite. Uh, we've got some, some lather built up in here. Look look at that. Nice. On my Omega Barber Pole brush. In my Hendrix bowl. Endless stainless bowl. Gunmetal gray on the outside. And what are we shaving with today? Well, as I promised. As I promised. From Goodfellas Smile, Orazio Goodfellas. This guy right here. That's the it's the Lord of the Rings razor. Valinar. It's a, a region in the Lord of the Rings realm. It's about six thousand miles from Middle Earth, if I remember correctly. I may remember correctly. I don't know. I do know some things. I mean, that's what I do. I shave and I know things. I did the unboxing the other day, and here it is in all of its glory. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? That's a re real different feel on the handle. When you take it out, the tube comes out so you can clean it. And it's two piece up here. So it's actually a four piece design. There's the blade, blade reveal. Look at that's nice. 
doesn't look like it's going to be too bad. I've got a fatigue blade in here. And let's do it, shall we? Already taken care of two of the three S's. Let's get to the third, shall we? Ah, there's my towel. Want to make sure I have my towel. Two of the three S's. Let's do the third. Let's get to the shave, shall we? Let's get some water on the face, because as you know, hydration is important. Deacon tip number one. Got up this morning, the alarm went off, and it was 65 degrees. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I love it. Love it. This is what fall is supposed to be. But it is going up into the mid-80s. So, eh, men's are men's, you know? Get some of this gorgeous lather on here. Mm -hmm. Oh, the smell of this. <sighs> Brings me back to New York. Back to my great-grandfather's barbershop on Bell Boulevard. He used to work at a place called Pace. And this is what the front and the back of the shop goes. You don't talk about what went on in the back of the shop. You know what I mean. That's where the, the secret meetings went on. All right. This, this is the first shave with this. I've not shaved with it. I haven't done a test shave with it. Let's see how we do. Not bad. There's some blade feel to it. But not a lot. I would say... Just on a guess, this is maybe a, a medium type of aggression. Not overly, but it feels like it's going to be efficient. At least I would hope it is. Feels really nice. Let's do a quick reverse. The Monica soaps always have that nice, nice slickness, probably from a combination of things, but mostly I think because of the emu oil that she uses. And it's good for your skin. There we go. First pass is done. Let's see how we did, shall we? Wow. Nice. Mild but effective. I will say that.
So hopefully, when I get to the office, it's going to be a nice quiet day. I can do what I need to do instead of putting out fires and, oh, this isn't working. Eugene, you got to come do this real quick. I need it. I need it now. Have you tried turning it off and on again? That's always my first question. All right, second pass. This does feel real good. It has a nice feel to it. It's just the, the handle can take a little getting used to. There is no side blade reveal here. It's just there and I'm not touching that. <laughs> my mom, my mama didn't raise no fool. We bowled last night, just to continue. We took two out of three. We didn't take total wood, but we took two out of three. And that's pretty good. I'll take two out of three every night. The lane conditions changed really fast last night. First, first game I did really well. Second game, you'd think I was learning to bowl. I couldn't get that ball to hook for anything. So third game, I finally decided to adjust, get another adjustment to where I was standing and pretty much almost throw directly at an angle into the pocket. And I started to hit there. That's not normal for me. But it was just very odd that the lanes changed that quick. And there were only two lefties bowling. I mean, I can understand if there were four or five of us bowling on that side of the lanes, but whatever. Second pass runs. Let's see how we did. Well, just a couple of spots, but we're gonna gonna give it a quick quick pass. I love this lather. I love this scent. I'm really liking the feel on this razor. I was, when I did the unboxing, Sig Solo, check out his YouTube channel as well. He's another friend of the channel. Posted that he thought it was a beautiful razor, Lord of the Rings. And he says, must resist, resist, resist. I said to him, resistance is futile. He says, ordered. So, Sig, if you're watching, I think you're going to like this. I, I really do.
like I said, mild but effective, I believe, is what I, how I would say this. It's not, not, a, not a bleed feel. But it is there. I think I quote myself. That was operator error. My hands flipped a little. I'll do up on this one again. I'm going to go across. It's a new razor. I don't want to tempt fate. Scripture tells us, Thou shalt not put the Lord thy God to the test. I ain't putting this thing to the test. Yeah, I, t I told you I'd quote myself. See? There's a little alum one that'll take care of it. Final rinse. Let's see how we did. Wow. Nice. A little bit right here. There we go. Better, much better. All right. Let's do a fresh water rinse. Yeah, that's a good touch there. You can feel it when you're rinsing off. A little water on the Allen block. All right, yeah. Just want to make sure. Nothing? That. Forgot the old pro tip number two. Don't address... In the, take two. <clears throat> don't ingest the alum. Don't do that. That's not good. Where's my towel? Where's my super suit? Where's my towel? Go to the Frankie Dry, especially today being we're back in the old old neighborhood with the made man. Which was really, really good. Today it's one of those, one of those days where we need it in the back. Get some of the alum off. Did not ingest it that time. All right, face is nice and dry. All right, hopefully we're better today, Luca. I gotta work on my shot. <laughs> Shake your action. Shake your action. Because Monica's got all those wonderful oils in this, and you wanna make sure you get them mixed up. Aloe vera witch hazel. Abyssinian sea emu. Red castor evening primrose. Rosehip. Oils. Comfrey, Candola. I can't even pronounce that one. Oat marshmallow, 
green tea extracts, liquid silk, and of course the magical fragrance. Leather and talc brings me back. I love it. Absolutely love it. Oh, oh great grandpa would be proud. And of course, the finisher. Perfect. Perfect. Fabulous. All right. So that's our shave for today. Great shave. Unfortunately, this is unobtainium. I'm sorry for those that missed out. Great soap. Along with the splash. Yeah, I think you gotta ask Monica especially nice for this if you want it. Mafia gentlemen. And of course, the star of our shave today, the Valionar from Goodfellas Smile. Lord of the Rings type theme. I've seen no one post that they've gotten the ring yet. Everybody that's saying, no, I didn't get the ring. Somebody will chime in, well, you need to order another one. Uh, I, I, I don't think I could, uh, I could do that. I don't think I could get one. This one was a, well, anyway, this was sent to me. I don't think I could just justify ordering it just to see if I get a ring. And then I didn't have two of these beautiful razors. Anyway. That's our shave for today. If shaving is not one of the most exhilarating parts of your day, you might be doing something wrong. And as always, be good to yourselves and to each other. We'll see you on Friday for who knows what. But most important, have a great day and smooth shaves. Ciao for now.